I mean, our shared vision at Curry is probably the same as almost every other school in Scotland, and it's to create an environment within, within which every single one of our young people feel valued and can genuinely find what their passion is and realise their full potential. Our shared vision is for all pupils to be given equal opportunities, for, for students to be given experiences um, and to, for them to really, I suppose, find an interest that they've got and for us to help them pursue that as well. I would say. Our developing young workforce kind of vision is, is based on um, the skills framework which we have uh, as part of uh, what we adapted for our school as part of the building the curriculum documentation that's come up from the Scottish Government um, and um, we've um, looked to develop the Developing Young Workforce initiative particularly off the back of road trips and um, with things like the World of Work Week um, and in helping children identify what the skills are that they're developing within classroom situations are applicable to the world of work and, you know, outside of school. Um, when it comes to DYW, when it comes to that whole enterprising schools um, aspect of our vision, it doesn't sit on its own. It's, it's just part of our entire vision. Um, and that's about making sure that all our young people are well-rounded human beings, that they develop intellectually, they develop socially, they develop emotionally, um, and they develop all the skills that are going to help them in their lives. Also, it's very important to try and manage workload. We all know that staff are going through the National Five, the higher and the advanced higher changes, and being able to manage and see how all of the career education standards, the work placement standards, help to make us uh, students aware of where that subject is leading and making it easier for staff. Hence, our skills framework, how the skills that we identified are mapped into the career education standards allowing that to become part of everyday practice and that's a challenge of giving time for staff to be able to work on that. Obviously developing the young workforce permeates basically everything we do. Um, so I'm an English teacher and as part of almost all of our lessons we talk a lot about um, well, what are the connections between the skills they're learning in English to the way that they're going to then use them out there in the real world. 